Good afternoon, Fort Collins. I'm Jeff Sporta, the police chief, and I wanted to give you all an update on some things that are going on in and around town. First off, you know, we had the homicide on July 5th that is still open and active, and we are asking the community for help. So we put out a new press release with some additional information. Please check it out. If there's anything in there that helps you remember something, please give us a call. Next up, I want to remind the community we're going to be out and about through Old Town and through Midtown, up and down College Avenue again this weekend, addressing some of the driving behaviors that we have seen. We've got many calls, and we've seen it ourselves, people driving very badly. You know, whether that's drag racing, squealing tires, speeding, not obeying traffic, direction signals, any of those things, we're going to be out and about addressing those. We wrote dozens of tickets last weekend. We've been trying to educate people on this, and uh, it's unsafe the way some are driving and we're going to be out there enforcing the law again this weekend so if you're coming out to enjoy the flowers or you're coming out to see nelly or the spin doctors or one of the other concerts that are here in town please drive safely you know i also want to talk about an arrest that some of our officers made in old town last weekend you know we got a call of somebody who was uh had their vehicle parked and they had guns in their car well the car was broken into and the guns were stolen a short time later, someone was walking by a car and heard a shotgun being racked. They called the police immediately. Officers showed up, heard the same sounds. We identified two people, and we were able to take them into custody. And lo and behold, there were the guns that they had just stolen as well. So I bring that up just to say what an amazing job our officers do on a daily basis. This is just one example. Criminals that are out there stealing guns, and then not wanting to listen to the police when their commands. Officers are giving them directions that they didn't want to follow. That's usually a very bad combination, being armed and not listening to the police. Yet our officers use de-escalation tactics, they use time and distance, and they were able to safely take them into custody. And so I really just wanted to say thank you to our officers, and that's emblematic of what is going on throughout this entire city with Fort Collins Police Service officers. You know, we just had an incident uh, this past week. A veteran sitting in front of a fast food restaurant was killed. And within 26 hours, our detectives figured out who this person was and were able to go where we heard he was and uh, take him into custody. And that's a lot easier said than done. These detectives responded quickly to someone who they know just killed someone the day before, is still armed, still has a stolen vehicle, and yet they're able to safely take him into custody. And it's just a fantastic job by members of Fort Collins Police Services. So I just wanted to publicly Make sure that every resident knew how proud I was and hopefully how proud all of you are of our officers here in Fort Collins. You know, wearing this badge, this means that they have been through a lot. They've been through the backgrounds. They have been through the best training. They have the best trainers, the equipment they have. So please know that we want to have these national discussions and continue having discussions. We're all about them. We're talking about mental health and mental health response team. We're all in. We think those are great discussions to be had. But at the end of the day, we all know police officers are needed in this community and every community, and you better have the best police officers. And here in Fort Collins, we do have that. So I just wanted to publicly say thank you to every member of Fort Collins Police Services for the manner in which you carry out your duties. You're appreciated. You make a difference. Thank you. I wish everyone to have a great weekend. And if you see a member of Fort Collins Police Services, please walk up and talk to them. I promise you, you will leave impressed. Thanks, Fort Collins. Talk to you soon.